Hi everyone, it's Caroline here. <clears throat> Just popping on this morning to show you um, a stencil that I've got from uh, Funky Fossil. It's called uh, December 25 on there, which is DEC-25, <clears throat> if you're looking for it. Um, and all I did was I went over with my stencil and scraped over with um, the uh, eyes ink diamond pastes. Uh, which are fabulous. I mean, they are a glitter paste to start with. Uh, you can put these on any surface. They're brilliant. Uh, if you do MDF and that sort of thing, you know, it's so thick uh, to use. Uh, it gives a lovely, can you see that? It gives a lovely finish. So and <clears throat> that seems to last forever because when you scrape it on, you don't need that much. Um, and I think I've shown this in one of my other videos to use on um, on a stencil uh, for uh, Imala. So yeah, worth, uh, it's, these are these are worth looking at and getting. Um, and those are from Stamps by Me on the How to Craft Network channel. I will leave links uh, uh, the, underneath the video for you to see. Uh, and what I did was, do you know, it only took me half an hour, and I got six cards. Um, uh, done with the paste, left them overnight to dry and this morning I just matte and layered uh, quick and easy and even that uh, as a card on its own to send through the post uh, is a beautiful card isn't it you'd be happy to get that wouldn't you and of course it'll just go normal post if you start putting uh, uh, extra on like this the you know the sentiments on if you put them on a pad like I've done with that one uh, obviously, it might, I don't think that'll go through normal post. I'll check, but um, I think it will probably be a large letter. But it depends who you're sending to and what you want to send. But <clears throat> this, uh, either as a base and adding things on top, um, you know, you could have uh, uh, one of your stamp pictures inside as well as a sentiment. Um, I did gold. I did red. I did a green. That's fabulous, isn't it? And I did this one, uh, I did over with the, a blue, and then I sprinkled with silver glitter. So all of these I've sprinkled, put my paste on, and then sprinkled a little bit of glitter on top, just to give it that extra little sparkle. <coughs> Excuse me, and it's come out really well. This one that, that I've done, which has come out as a, as a really snowy look, can you see that? Um... I used the eyes ink texture paste and this is called beads texture and um, even on your cards if you're wanting a snow effect on your cards this is fabulous uh, and it really looks like snow especially with uh, a bit of glitter on top and the glitter I used was the Chloe's Sparkalicious Glitter uh, called Snowball uh, which works absolutely perfect for a snow effect um, and it's giving it that little bit of a puffy look and I put a sentiment on there like I say you can dress these as easily as you want but um, I think this this stencil is absolutely brilliant and also you, you can use it with your inks across your distress oxides uh, and then just glitter up with a glitter pen if you want you've got so many options with this for your Christmas cards absolutely fabulous well I hope you've enjoyed that and if it's any help to you thanks for watching have a good day bye bye